let's play a game. It's a game between player number one and player number two. Let's play with cards. So we've got a special deck of cards. Uh, not that special, it's just that all the face cards have been removed. So uh, what's in here is just uh, numbers. Uh, let's put out eight cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's card the rest. Now, player one and player two are going to take turns picking up cards. Um, on every turn, a player has a choice to pick up the outer cards, one of the outer cards, either this one here or that one here. Okay. So let's just play it. Let's say player one starts. He's got a choice between the ten and the ten, so maybe he chooses this one. Here. Now, number two has a choice between the ten and the seven, so maybe he goes for the seven. Player one, choice between nine and ten, maybe he goes for the ten. And then number two chooses again, um, this one chooses, this one chooses, that one chooses. Okay, done. Now who wins? Well, for that, we just add up the numbers in the two piles. Whoever got more wins. All right. Pretty straightforward. Okay, now... The trick here is that number one, whoever starts, can force a win. and can force a win in a very simple way. Well, a win or at least a draw. Most of the times you can force a win. So let's show you how that works. So number one um, knows the secret, knows how to win. Here's what it does. So to explain, I've, I've arranged eight cards in a special way. Um, we're going to put one red, one black, one red, one black. Okay. So, with this sort of arrangement here, you've got uh, a black one in the first position, in the third position, the fifth position, the seventh position. So all odd number cards are black, and all even number cards are red. Okay, now I say, if number one starts, he can guarantee to win. How does he do it? Well, first of all, while all this dealing is happening, he has to add up all the black cards, all odd number cards. 8 plus 8 is 16, plus 5 is 21, plus 9 is 30. So the black sum is 30. He has to also add up all the, the red numbers, so all the even numbered numbers here. So it's 3 plus 8 is 11, plus 4 is 15, plus 6 is 21, so the red sum is 21. Now what number one can control if he starts is he can control that in the end he's got all the black cards. No matter what number two does, uh, he's got all the black cards. How does he do this? Well, number one starts. So he goes for the black card that's open. Okay. Now what about number two? Well, number two has a choice now between left and right, but both are red cards. So he's going to go for a red card, maybe that one here. But that opens up uh, a black card. Okay, so take that black card. And now number two has a choice. Um, it's going to be either a red or a knight. So if he chooses maybe the four. And here, here's something important. Here's something important. Or well, something else important. Uh, wherever number two chooses, that's where the next black card comes up. right? So I definitely choose that one. Let's see. He chooses that red card. So then the black card comes up on that side. So I choose that and then he has to choose that red card. And in the end, number one gets all the black cards and of course gets a sum of 30. And number two gets all the red cards with a sum of 21. So loses. Now the worst thing that can happen here is that you get two equal sums, in which case you can always only guarantee a draw. But that's okay. Now, usually, of course, cards don't get dealt so that you have a nice red, black, red, black, red, black ordering. Usually they are all over the place, right? They're all over the place. What do you do then? Well, let's try it. So shuffle these cards. Deal them again. So let's get rid of these sums. OK, 
Okay, so that's that's pretty arbitrary. So we have to do two sums. The first one is all the odd numbered cards. So it's six plus four is ten, plus eight is eighteen, plus five is twenty-three. So twenty-three on this side. Let's see what they can write this like this. So twenty three. Even number cards, even number cards. Well, this is this one plus that one plus that one plus that one. So let's just write it down over here. So basically, this is one of the even number cards. So let's count from here. 8 plus 9 is 17, plus 8 is 25, plus 3 is 28. So second sum is 28. Right. Okay, so number 1 starts again. Number 1 starts again. Uh, what is he going to do? Well, he's going to go for the 28. Which cards are those? Well, it's the 8, the 9, the 8, the 3. Those he wants, right? Okay, so the only thing you have to now do is you choose this one here. Okay? Choose this one. Now, as you remember, it doesn't matter what the other person does. Maybe he chooses the 6 here. Yeah. Then what you have to do, you have to always follow what he does. So you go for this one here. Now, um, what about number two? We can choose again. Maybe he goes for the five. You follow. Maybe he goes for the eight. You follow. Okay, now let's check. Eight plus three is eleven. Twenty. Twenty-eight. Okay, that's the other one. So that's how you perform the trick. 